Good morning, Don Lane, Fraser Valley News. Your morning news update for this Monday, October the 7th. And a couple of stories on the go. The search searches continue for two people, one of which is that mushroom picker uh, just outside of Lindell Beach, Cultus Lake, who uh, went missing on uh, Thursday. The 82-year-old has not been seen since, and that search continues with search and rescue. Also, we're waiting for more information on what was supposed to be a drone search for Christopher Couture. And uh, he went missing uh, back in January, uh, back at the beginning of the year. And uh, that was almost in the same area, uh, just a little further over uh, by Elk Lake. Uh, not so much the same area, but in the same style of uh, terrain. Uh, so that uh, is posing a situation that um, everybody wants closure on both counts of that. Also, Fraser Valley, or University of Fraser Valley, the men's golf team, Congratulations to them. They won the Canada West Championship. All the details and uh, scores uh, are up on FBN, FraserValleyNewsNetwork.com. Uh, we still not have heard, heard anything from Abbotsford or other areas, but in Chilliwack, Chilliwack Citizens for Change will start up, quote, the vote bus, and that is to help people who are mobility challenged or do not have a ride to a polling station on October 21st to make sure they can get out and cast their vote. And all that information is up on FBN, FraserValleyNewsNetwork.com. MCC Bucket of Thanks campaign is now underway for the rest of the week. And uh, Kent Harrison Arts Council, the small works uh, call for entry uh, for that uh, contest is up and running. And uh, all the information up on FBN. There's something we should know about. Let us know. FraserValleyNewsNetwork.com, FBN at Shaw.ca, or for our television friends, if you need them, News at ChillTV.ca. News at ChillTV.ca. And a reminder, Chill TV will have extensive election night coverage starting at 6.30, half an hour before the polls close, and then at 7 o'clock, uh, of course, all the numbers. We'll, we'll see if it's a, a quick election or a long night. I have a feeling it could be a long night. Have yourself a great day. It'll be a soggy day today. Don Lane, Fraser Valley News.